Precision Remotes PRL, has teamed with General Dynamics Land Systems to develop one of the first successful wireless remotely controlled weaponized robots, WMUT, Weaponized Man and Man Utility Transport. PRL has been developing and manufacturing remotely operated weapon stations, ROWs, and surveillance platforms since 1998, providing a powerful protection capability in any operational environment. GDLS and PRL both have a long history of government and commercial partnerships that have given them the robotic functional knowledge needed to create the WMUT. General Dynamics Land Systems GDLS, develops automated systems for a broad range of commercial and government programs. We are a recognized leader in the design of tactical robotics and advanced automation systems for military, government, and industrial markets. With decades of expertise developing unmanned systems for the military and manufacturing automation systems for the USPS and commercial customers, GDRS provides cutting-edge solutions for today's most demanding technical challenges. GDLS also designs and builds sophisticated sensors, sensor processing, command and control, and electromechanical systems that enable autonomous vehicle operations. Our capabilities and technologies have been successfully demonstrated time and again on many major DOD and government programs, including the Mobile Detection Assessment and Response System, DARS, Army Brigade Combat Team Modernization, BCM, Autonomous Navigation System, ANS, the Robotics Collaborative Technology Alliance, RCTA, and the Combat Autonomous Mobility System, CAMS. Vehicle is designed for forward deployed, dismounted small units that can benefit from the robotic transport of equipment and supplies and all types of terrain. The warfighter will be able to bring robotically controlled sustainable firepower with the M2 heavy machine gun on an enemy out to 1,200 meters away while having cover from enemy fire. The squad would benefit from having the M2 automated and remotely controlled, thereby increasing its force protection during its engagements with enemy forces and positions. This technology would be employed at the squad and platoon levels, specifically the weapons squad. 